I'm a man with a plan. And that plan is to dig a secret tunnel connecting my garage to the outside. So that when the Spetsnaz raids my garage, I can easily escape and save my life. Johnny Peter here, and today I'm going to show you the progress that I've made on my secret tunnel. Autobots, roll out! When I said that this tunnel is going to be secret, I really meant it. Now, let's play a little game. As you can clearly see, this is my floor right here, the floor of my garage that I'm standing on. And it's made out of these asbestos plates right here, one centimeter in thickness. Now, your task is to determine under which plate there is a secret trap door to my current, current basement, alright? Now, take a good close look at these plates right here. Under one of them, there's a secret tunnel. It could be this plate, it could be that one. Let's roll my chair. It could be uh, maybe under the carpet, who knows? Now take a good, nice, close look and I'm going to reveal the answer in three, two, one. Did you guess it? It's that plate over there. Let me open it up. We take this nail put it in the gap between the plates, and then just lift it up. Ooh, secret basement! Take the strings, pull them up, and we're good to go! See you later! Alright man, we made it into the basement right here. That is where I crawled inside. This is the ventilation shaft right here. And this is the main tunnel right here. Actually, let me turn off the light right now. So I don't waste electricity by burning two um, bulbs at the same time. There. Oh. Okay, so what I did from the last time, I installed two extra... Um, reinforcements right here on the walls this board and this board and obviously on the ceiling so now i have one two three four um reinforcements on the walls all right man so this is the plan right here first i'm gonna show you this right here this is my garage right here and this is the secret underground area that i'm going to build right here this part Left to the knife, I have already dug out, but the part on the right is yet to be built. So I'm currently located in this tunnel right here, facing this direction. Alright, now it's time for my bulletproof plan that's going to work 100% and it's going to help me avoid the Spetsnaz, alright? So basically, right, this is the main entrance of my garage right here, the main doors right here. So basically, the Spetsnaz is going to run up here and the door is locked and they're not going to be able to open it, alright? So what I'm going to do, I'm going to open the doors for them, yes, I'm a very kind person. Then I'm going to run down here into my um, basement, lock it. Then I'm going to quickly, swiftly crawl through this tunnel right here, exit it out, and then sprint away, saving my own life. I mean, I must say, my genius sometimes scares me. Like this is this plan will work 100%. I truly believe it, guys. Okay, while we're still inside the tunnel, let me tell you about the technology of how I dig this tunnel safely. So I follow basically um, three steps to dig um, my tunnel right here. And now we're currently, let me just go back. As you can see, the wall is completely flat and there's these um, metal spikes uh, poking um, from the wall. And we're currently at step one. So step one right here is to put these like uh, metal needles, metal rods right here. And that is to reinforce the top of the tunnel right here. As you can see, I put quite a lot of them. That is to reinforce this, uh, the mo most vulnerable spot. Then the second step is to dug out like this um, under part right here. Then step three is to completely um, excavate this area, um, including the ceiling, 
and then the step four is step one basically and that is just to put um new side reinforcement by doing it this way i guarantee that none of my um vital body parts are under um unsupported ground meaning that when i dug the when i dig the tunnel only my hands are under um unsupported ground and meaning if the ground collapses i'm pretty much completely safe because my whole body um, is under these wooden reinforcements. Okay, to show you the next um, step in my plan, I need to go outside. All right, we are outside, and this is where the exit is going to be roughly located. So, in the drawing, as you can clearly see, this is the tunnel right here. And in real life, it would roughly go um right here where that sign is to the left of it so this is the window and the tunnel would go roughly um right here i don't know how um or what kind of design i'm going to choose but this is the rough idea right here we have the tunnel then the hatch will be um somewhere right here and yeah this is the wall of the garage right here as you can clearly see but yeah but this is the rough idea I might have to um uh, I might have to modify it of course but uh you get the rough idea. Tunnel goes right here, there's a hatch and yeah, pretty much it. Well, I hope that you got the rough idea of what I'm going to do. So yeah, that was the plan that I'll, that I'll try to follow in the following days and weeks or maybe in, maybe actually months. I'll have to see how everything um turns out. But yeah, I'm Johnny Peter, do the impossible, make it happen, and I'll see you next time. Peace.